Officer Kenneth McDougall's day starts early in downtown Greensboro. This is this district or Superior Court case? This district. In his second floor office, you won't find any pictures of his family or friends. In his line of work, any inkling of his personal life could put them at risk. Instead, you'll find banners, posters, and other gadgets showing the next most important thing in his life. I love my Knicks. Originally from Brooklyn, New York, Officer McDougald saw what street life did to some of his own friends. He moved to North Carolina to get away from it all, but realized working with that group of troubled people was actually his calling. When you don't have any parental support, or you know, you're poor, and you don't have any structure, because I saw how that environment could cause people to end up the way they were. He's been at it for almost 20 years now. I'm here to supervise them in the community and try to keep them on the right path. But he adds to his list of duties nearly every day. That was going to be overdosed. They, they found him in there on the, on the floor. He knows it's a stressful job, but it's one he enjoys. So if I see somebody that I used to supervise that completed successfully and then they come up to me and they say, hey, uh, I'm doing great, I, I got a good job, I'm staying out of trouble, got my own place now, you know, that, that's the fulfilling part to me. That's, that's what keeps me coming back. At the end of the day, Officer McDougald wouldn't change a thing. In Greensboro, Laura Brache, WFMY News 2.